Get involved. All right, ready? Yeah. Hey everyone, it's I'm Nick. I'm Carlo. And Zach was missing again. And he's not here. Yep, he's not here. Um, Vision Films 100 sent us a request to make a video on the production of a feature film. We're going to put a link to his channel right here. So listen up guys, if you guys have any requests for videos like Vision Films 100 did, we will try our best to make a video for you and we'll even put the link to your channel. Basically in our anything video. anything yeah. you would anything like. film related that you'd like us to uh, do for you. I mean, we can only help to a certain extent, but yeah. we'll give you our opinion. We will definitely do our best. So our first tutorial was uh how, how to write a script, uh, yeah. How to write a feature script, how to write a short script, any type of script writing. Go look at that. That's yeah, there we'll put a link right there. That's it. And but today this one is going to be about the production of a feature film and tips and tricks that we learned from our, our experience. experience. I'm going to give you tips and tricks from a directing standpoint. He's going to give you one from an acting standpoint so you can guys can kind of mix and match mix them together. And, you know, and yeah. uh, hopefully this helps you out, Vision Films 100. Let's get started. Also, wait. Say it again. It's, uh, it's Nick's birthday tomorrow. Everybody, uh, give, give Nick... Thanks, uh, in the comments, guys. I want to see at least 20 happy birthday Nicks. Okay. Got a haircut. You got a haircut. Just just for the occasion. Yeah. Turning 17. 17 year old filmmaker director. Yes. And happy Easter from all of us here at Yes, Christmas. happy Easter. Yeah. Happy Easter. So what do we have on the board? On the board, we Pe just wrote Peanut Butter Brawl 2. Peanut Butter Brawl 2. You guys, we are putting out another one. If you haven't seen our first one, go watch it. Holy crap, I'm gonna be putting a lot of links in this. There's gonna be a lot of links. <laughs> There's Peanut Butter Brawl 1. And so, in about a week or so, we're not gonna have much out this weekend because it's Easter. It's Easter. But next weekend we'll try and put out Peanut Butter Brawl 2. And uh, Tip Top Trailers. And Tip Top Trailers. We're going to get that film. And we're working on, we're also, still working tell on the us feature what, film. Uh, tell us what you want to do for the Tip Top Trailer if you have no idea. Still working on the feature film script. Now we're about halfway done. It's really Around good. there. Really um, good. We're going to be getting a couple new actors in for that. Yeah. Marcel, you know who I'm talking about. Marcel, no. you, you. Marcel, Marcel you cutie. You. Okay. Yeah. And, um... Yeah. Oh, also, we're going to be doing another big one like Insanity. Yeah. We have, like you have to start the script for that. So just look. Like, like, ins like Insanity. Oh, Insanity. Insanity. There's there another one. Is. There's Insanity. There's another one right there. Yeah, we put a lot. All right. Of okay. So, okay, we're going to start on the tutorial, guys. All right, Here guys. Go. Keep watching. So, how to make a feature film from an actor standpoint, actor kind of script writer type of thing, you know what I'm saying? Um, okay, some tips. Uh, it's always good from when you're filming whether it's a short or a long or a feature or whatever you're filming, it's good to stay organized, you know, um, take a look at the script, don't go into like, don't go into your, to, to, to acting, you know, it is an actor, don't go into like filming without even taking a look at the script, look at the script, what, Just, you know, look at it, okay, look at your lines, you know, take a look at what you're dealing with, get, get used to the character because you don't want to have to go there, have to practice and then waste time, Okay, get the lines wrong, waste more time trying to fix, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you, you, you get it, you get it. Staying organized, um, also on staying organized, um, make sure that, you know, you stay serious, you get your shit done. Beep that out, please. And, and um, yeah, so get, get, like, get it done. We joke around a lot, but it's great to, stay, you know, stay serious, get the stuff done, and uh, that'll keep you guys, like, focused and, and whatnot. Uh, also... Uh, another tip is to always have, you know, everybody on board with the, like, the ideas going along. Don't have people coming in not knowing what they're doing, whether it's, like, an actor or anybody. Kind of, like, you know, get everybody knowing what you're doing. All your roles. Roles are important when it comes to filming. Uh, you have to know, you know, who's playing what, who's doing what, who's lighting what. You have to be on the ball. So, basically, organization is key. All right, guys. So, um, I'm the director. I'm Jen Films and I do the directing stuff. So I'm going to try and give you my kind of insight about how to make a feature film based on how I would do things from a directing standpoint. Um, directing is really tough because uh, there's a ton of things going on, especially when you have guys like us where you just like fool around all the time. It's hard to get things organized. All the time. But it's really good to kind of have a dedicated casting crew. Like you want to have, make sure your actors are on, on, on ball with what you see the film to be. So when you read over the script and you have a vision for that, you want to make sure that they're like on the same page with you so they can perform to what you want them to perform to. Also, 
make sure you talk to them after every single shot. Uh, like Giancarlo knows, I go and talk to him and uh, even Andrew in Insanity. Oh, I couldn't move that, I'm sorry. Sorry, that doesn't matter. Um, like I, talk, I talk to the actors almost after every single shot, give them little tips about what they're doing good, what they're doing not, not, not doing good, how it's coming along, if it's, it's matching the vision that you have, uh, and that's really important. Also, I mean, we don't, we're pretty independent filmmaking, pretty much have really low budget stuff, so we don't really have a cast, but, I mean, a crew, but um, uh, we're getting new equipment soon. Yeah. Uh, we're getting, like, more lights, we're getting uh, audio is? equipment, I'm getting... Audio new, equipment, yeah. I'm getting a new camera soon. So, with all that stuff combined, and since we're doing two-system audio and stuff like that, if you're doing that where you have to boom a mic, you have to have a dedicated crew. You've got to have one guy doing the mic, you got to have one guy doing the cameraman, you got to have one guy uh, clapping the slate. You have to have a bunch of different people doing their thing and make sure that they're on the, on the ball with it, right? You want to make sure that they're doing their job so that things s flow smoothly. Um, also, with independent filmmaking, you usually are not going to have a very long time to um, film a certain scene and stuff like that. So you really got to get cracking. Generally, we have about four hours to film something. In the yeah. afternoon, for around one to, four, one to four, one to five ish, kind of around there. Um, for our short films, usually we get them done pretty quick because we, we learn to work fast from our experience. But um, when we get started on this feature film production, which is probably going to happen sometime in the summer, uh, hopefully we'll have it up by when. I said October, November in the comments before. Oh, did you actually? Yeah, so I thought we were, we're, getting, gonna try I thought we were getting it up by July. <laughs> You're out of your mind. It's not going to happen. It's okay. Hopefully we'll have it up by October, for, November for you guys. But that's going to be a big, huge project, and pretty much during that time period, you're not going to get that many videos from us because we're going to be working on that. Yeah, and when you're also another tip, when you're working on something like that, we started months, months before. You have to be prepared. Yeah, we actually started creating the idea for this. November, I think. I would say in November. No yeah. Yeah, I would say November. In November, we no, 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 a little later in November, maybe January, early January. Either way, we were. We, yeah, months. Before. So we. From like the pre-production process to the production process is a long time period. I want to start filming sometime in June. That sounds about right. Yeah, sometime in June. So from January to June, that's a while. It's quite a few months there. And we're still not totally prepared. We're still working on the script. Yep. So make sure you guys have everything prepared. Make a, a shot list. Make make sure you have a props list. Yes. This is important. We have We those. did this for the pending, which we haven't filmed yet. That will be coming out hopefully soon yeah. when we get our new equipment and stuff. Um, a props list, basically go through your script, write down all the props you are going to need for every single scene so that you don't get to uh, your set and then not have any of the props, like, be missing props, because that's going to screw you up big time. Huge. Huge. Big time. So make sure you really want to get that done. It's, kind of, it's really extremely important to do that. Uh, shot list, casting call. That's important too. We did that for the pendant as well. We're pretty much ready with the pendant, don't you think? Oh, I'm getting really, my arm is getting, yeah. I'm going to just, uh, okay. We're, we're getting we're getting pretty close to the pendant, right? Uh, sorry, say that we, again. We did a lot of pre-production for the pendant. We're ready. Oh, for that. oh yeah, yeah. We I started think we're ready. The Honestly, if we got the camera tomorrow and all the equipment tomorrow, we can start shooting. It. Yeah, we, we even shot a video for you guys of us calling places, but we didn't put that out. What was it? What? When we were calling the. Oh yeah, that's right. We were calling the places. We, this uh, is what we did um, for that as a part of the pre-production process. Even this is more production. This is just tip tip feature film. Yeah. Um, we did a casting call. Get your friends. I know you're not gonna have like a huge act, like a Don't, realm of actors yeah. to choose from, but from the people you do have, generally they're gonna be your friends. Make sure you cast them and make them read over the script. Have them over, read over the script, rehearse it, and then you choose the director. Make sure you make the proper decision and choose who is best for each particular part. Um, like we with the pen, and we did a, we brought in Giancarlo and Andrew because we know we, we knew we wanted both of them to star in that, right? Yeah. And uh, we did a casting call for that, so that's really a big help. Make sure you do that. But other than that, the main key thing is keeping yourself organized on set and... Um, offset too. And offset as well, while you're not shooting. Make sure you have everything prepped up. Rehearse if you have time beforehand so you're ready to shoot. And uh, hopefully things will go well. So those are my tips from a directing standpoint on the production of a feature film, which we will get started on soon. Once again, this is our second one. Alright guys. Vision Films 100. I hope you. I hope that helps you out. He's starting on a feature film project. He told us over spring break. Yep. So good luck with that. Hopefully this helped out a little bit. Um, happy Easter to all you guys. Yep. Um, these are just a few tips and tricks that we threw together. There's many, uh, there's more. Many more. So expect a few more videos like this in the future. Yep. Just tutorials here and there. And um, that's about it. Uh, 
Oh. We thank you for all the support yep. that you guys have been giving Special us. Special thanks to Unbounded Films. Connor, yeah. you're a great guy. Thanks a bunch for all the help. Uh, Real those, Deal Film School, yeah, Xander and Elliot, they're great. I'll put the links to all their channels here and those film those guys. Those film guys have been really supportive. Yep. Really all you guys, guys have really helped us out, so everybody. thank you so much. And if you guys have a request for a video or a tutorial that you want to see us do, um, just I, request it. Anything we'll give you, you a little bit of a shout a out in the film, video. Tip top trailers, a Anything. Hit us up. You want to see Nick dancing naked on the top of the table? That's you not do it. Just tell us, okay, guys? All right. All right. So yeah, inbox us or uh, go to our website, which I'll man, I'm gonna be putting links in. There's gonna be links day. everywhere. Um, Put it right here. See? Okay. I'll I'll I'll, I'll write down our website here. Yeah. Send us send us anything anything you want. Um, Talk it'll to be us. considered. Even if you want to see any like uh, short skits or anything. Mm. All right, and guys. Uh, go watch our latest copycat. And that's about it. That we have wrapped up everything we need to say in one video. Nice work. All right. Thanks, guys. Hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Happy Easter. Happy Easter. See you later. Bye. Bye.